Hey everyone, this is Real Lion right back at you again. I hate to do this, but hey, it is what it is, bro. The smoke is the smoke is, that's what it's about. Here is the twins, you know, the comedians, you know. And they want to talk about, because he called Trump supporters Uncle Tom, they are Uncle Toms. Anybody who vote for Trump, and talking about capitalism, and not knowing the whole picture, Getting caught up in Democrat or Republican. I can care less about either party. Why? Because it's up to me to take care of myself, for myself, by myself. Not being an entertainer. Not because I'm on TV and I got fame and fame, boys. It's all about who you are, what you stand for, period. And so-called black people don't stand for nothing. Know what they stand for? Whatever the boat and the wind blows, that's where we're going to go at, period. Meanwhile... Trump was talking about this and that because why? Those type of tactics is easier for people whose demographic for us money than it appeared to. Heck, I can care less because all of that 1776, that wasn't for you or me. That was for white folks. So let's not get caught up into that stuff. But because we deal with the spirit of self-hate and lack of knowledge of true self and fear, and we think because going along, getting along with tactics it got nothing to do with us. I'm going to tell you again, doesn't matter if you're Democrat or Republican. If you read and you study and you research the real capitalism, it doesn't favor you and me. That's the difference between people who talk about politics. And it's all about money. And it's all about cooning. And it's all about performing. And it's all about licking the boot of the oppressor. Why self hate and regular? How can we can't have our own political party if we're going to do that? When it stands for all of us, not some of us. Or because because if it's the narrative is this way or that way, I can give a damn about politics. Why? Because the politics that we're talking about is not for us. It's never gonna be for us. It's always gonna be looked down on. I don't care how much money you make, where you live, where you drive, where you shop. They think of us all the same. Don't think because some people is famous, they say it's right. No, that's their opinion and from their mindset. Because when it's all said and done. If it goes down, you're a black man, not a Republican man, period. I've never heard anybody getting pulled over to ask, would you a Republican or a Democrat? Or are you getting racially profiled on the store? Or because they look at your name and they want to dis discriminate against you, they ask you with your political views. It's irrelevant. It only matters to the status quo because people who don't know and don't care to know. That's what it is. And because a lot of us like the Hodges twins think because it's about money. Listen here, I probably don't have the kind of money, but I'll do well good for myself. I don't, without talking about politics, without getting involved in that, period. Because if I was an entertainer, I wouldn't get involved in that either way. I wouldn't care. You know what I'm saying? Because mo most of us who think it that way because think because, oh, white people laugh at my jokes. Oh, white people, well, I got friends with white people. That means nothing, man. came about... It's been real bad for a lot of us. It's just some of us are tolerable than another. Got to know what, how well spoken or how ghetto or how informed you sound. When are we going to rise up and stop worrying about divide and conquer tactics? Or conquer and divide? Or distractive stuff? Or, or pagan stuff? Or Christmas or Thanksgiving? It got nothing to do with much. A lot of us don't really know our real history, man. We don't know much or nothing. Only by what they tell us or what we think we know. And what I'm trying to tell so-called black people, get your own stuff. For your own, by your own, for your own, and your own people. Stop getting in something where, where, in a race where you don't win. That's simply what race means, competition. And on the surface, that sounds real cool and neat what they're trying to say. Big capitalism stuff. But in a, in a, in a longer run, what does it benefit you? It don't. It don't. And I got friends. I got very famous friends. You know what I mean? Very famous. If you know, if you got watch Black Panther, then you know who I'm talking about, who's the director of that. But that's needed to say we talking about income brackets. I understand that what they're trying to say. But as a whole, as a body, if you look at what the Republicans are doing to black people, they're making fools out of us. Why? Because majority of us, we got to go over the top. Oh, Trump is the, is the black man. All this other cooning and stuff. 
all that other extra stuff, let master know I'll lick in the boot of his oppressor. That's what it's about. Oh, you just mad because you this and you that, and I got the best part of the boot. That's all that sound. Oh, you a lefty, you a righty. No, I'm a black man. I don't give a damn about that. I don't give a damn about who's a Democrat or Republican. That's what I'm trying to say. Race simply means race and you inform. So it's up to woke brothers and me and anybody else who care about our people, not about mingling and about what somebody else thinks or what somebody else feel, or somebody else's objective, or somebody else, what's our objective? What's our opinion? What's our voice? Too much self-hate and distraction, and confusion. I'm mixed. There's no such thing as I'm a mixed race. You are what your father is. But because a lot of us, and like the Hodges twins, who want to jump on a Trump bandwagon, or a Democrat bandwagon, whatever it is. I don't care less about no Barack Obama. I don't care nothing about no, uh, none of that stuff. Cause none of that, and I'm from Chicago. He did absolutely nothing for people that, that, that look like me. Just like Trump. It's because it's divide and conquer. Here's the deal. They do Republicans the same way with rich people or people who are well off. They know about on a percentage thing that it's going to feasible them. So that's cool with them because why are we talking about money, capitalism, and preserving your dollar? Get that. Run that. All right? But not understanding that the far right will never sit down with you. The people who's really in control, not the ones that's in the middle, not the ones that's rest Republicans, but the far right, they think nothing of you. You know what I mean? They wouldn't spit on you if your shoe or if your body was on, on fire. The same thing with the radical left. Wing or right winger, it's all thing. Divide and conquer, conquer and divide. Same with the so Southern Poverty Law Center. Same thing the radical lefts that do purges and all this other racial stuff on the police department. All in the country. I mean, it's the same thing, man. But because we don't know or we some little talk thinking about monetization stuff, not looking at the big picture. Because the big picture it is, you telling kids it's cool to be a fool and a clown or, or Uncle Tom or to sell out or look like a simple Negro because you want to be a simple pack. Or because I want to say foolish things and not looking at the bigger picture. And the bigger picture is making us all look bad when we don't stand for nothing. We can't have our own political party. We're not tough enough. We're not intelligent enough. We're going to go along to get along because that's what we're saying. And there's nothing else to say about it, man. So when are we going to have our own political party? Rich, uh, 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 working class, poor. Because here's the difference when you talk about poor. Poor white people don't have the same problems. Yes, they don't have money, but here's the thing. They don't deal with systemic racism. They don't deal with bigotry. They don't deal with self-hate. They don't deal with they have to go over the top and make their people look bad for a dollar. Because why? They understand that they got to take one for the team. Like Ohio, Republican state. Indiana, they know they got to take one for the team. Why? As long as they can keep the majority of us distracted and confused and dealing with the spirit of self-hate and not understanding the real law.